two variations of makgeolli here. Um, one is a takju and one is a jeongju that I skimmed off the top. Um, this little guy um, is a blend of chapsar and hyunmi chapsar and it's a iyangju that I fermented for about a month. Okay. Um, it's kind of like medium to light body, little carbonation, dry. Um, yeah, and that's the flavor profile of that. And this guy is a um, sayangju, um, made out of, I think, just hyunmi chapsar. That's brown rice, um, brown sweet rice. And um, I infused it with chrysanthemum, and this was over like maybe oh. a month and a half. No, a month and a week. Yeah. Wow. So, and that's, okay, so that's four stages? Yeah, that's four stages. I actually didn't plan to make this four stages, but um, I really didn't like the flavor when it was in its third stage. So oh. I added a little bit of more rice and more time. Oh, well, that, that's, that's a good here. lesson to learn. Yeah. You can, you can always do something. Yeah, so I actually filtered it. And then I added more. Oh. I didn't know if that was like a thing, but I thought. But it is now. Like hypothetically, it would be a good method to get rid of the tartness. Wow. Um, so for either of these, um, is there any added yeast, or is it just no, from the nuruk? Just nuruk. And yeah. where do you get your nuruk? Um, so I think the place is called Kyungnam. Um, I get this oh. just big bag of stuff from this organic store. Oh. Um, yeah, and I think that's the regional name. I'm not exactly sure. Oh, <laughs> I'm not okay. In geography. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so yeah, so for me, I just have to go to H Mart and get what they have. Yeah, right? I have that too. Yeah. Um, but I I discovered this stuff. There's this great organic market near King at like right next door to King Spa in New Jersey, and oh. they sell these large bags of um, really good noodles. Oh, good to know. Mm -hmm. Okay, well that that's a good tip. <laughs> that's another good tip. And um, how did you learn how to make uh, um, makgeolli? I learned from my dad. So oh. I'm Korean, um, and my dad has been making makgeolli, you know, since ever. He learned from his mom, oh. and um, when I was a kid, I'd always help him. And then, you know, it's just kind of a part of like my muscle memory. And I started doing it myself and experimenting oh. with different rices and yeasts. And um, yeah, and, and now I live in Brooklyn. My family's from in California. Okay. Um, I live in Brooklyn, New York. And <laughs> well, that, well, that's fantastic. You have the, so you have some real traditional knowledge yeah, I get, but less technical I'm gonna, knowledge. I'm going to, I'm going to quiz you a lot. <laughs> less technical knowledge. <laughs> I have a lot of questions for you. <laughs> yeah. Well, well, that's great. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you. <laughs>